What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Tech Reacts where every beat counts. My name is Matt Tech. If you're new to the channel, welcome. So glad to have you here. We have a ton of fun. We've done a lot of music so far and super blown away with all of you guys who are going on this journey with me and, and making the suggestions. I'm trusting you with the future of this channel. We have a playlist. So we divided all the different artists into playlists. And um, there was an overwhelming request for Nightwish. Full transparency, I've heard of Nightwish. I've never actually listened to their music before. I did hear, I heard Floor Jansen perform Phantom of the Opera with Hank Port, Port um, many, 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 many years ago. And I think I was actually looking up different versions of Phantom of the Opera because my we had watched the movie adaptation here at the house and my daughter wanted to see the like a live performance of it. And I think I came across Flora Jansen performing that. So I know she's got a pretty, pretty powerhouse uh, vocal ability. But I have not heard any music from her band which I'm kind of ashamed of because I love me some symphonic rock. For probably 12 years, I played in a touring production of a tribute to the Trans-Siberian Orchestra, had the opportunity to headline in that show for a year in Branson, Missouri. Um, you can see how we were a little bit out of place in Branson, Missouri, which is why we're no longer there. But I love Trans-Siberian Orchestra. It's like some of my favorite music ever. So I'm really excited to get started with Ghost Love Score. It's a 10 minute video, but I'm assuming any of you who have watched other Nightwish reactions, longer videos are kind of the norm for you. So we're going to dive in. This is, this is Ghost Love Score. Now there were so many live versions that I picked the one that had the most amount of views. So this is from 10 years ago. It's just called Ghost Love Score Official Live. It's on the Nuclear Blast Records. It doesn't tell me where or when it's from showtime story time i guess is the tour name but this is it this is nightwish ghost love score Six, six, five, six, I believe is what I'm hearing. Let's, let's try this again. That's a cool opener. I like the choir. Is there a real choir there? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cool. Oh my gosh, so much sound. Is that Orlando Bloom on the drums? Nice. Yeah, let's go. That's cool. And then they go into this 4-4-3-4 four, four, four type of thing, which is very cool. Oh, this is going to be epic. So much sound. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. That's awesome. So much sound. That pipe thing is awesome. Nice. 
nice. That's a huge crowd. Oh wow, I have goosebumps. Look, look. What a voice. I, she, her soprano is unbelievable. She makes it look so effortless, too. The fact that you've got this beautiful. And then you got this da -da 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 right behind it. It's just so, like such a it, it's so different. It's so like counterpoint from each other um, that I actually love it more. Uh, she's she's quite beautiful as well. I have no idea what she's singing about. Uh, honestly, I'm not really like listening to the words, but because the music is ju is just captivating me. That's an interesting burning, um, like a bull. I live in Texas, so that looks like a longhorn to me. Cool. So who's this guy coming out? I wonder. She this. I knew from watching her in Phantom of the Opera that she has a lot of like schooled classical training to her. The way that she drops her jaw when sing because typically when people try to get power out, they like force it like this, and their neck get, like their neck, the veins pop, and the and the veins in their head pop. She can get so much sound out of her voice with like little effort because she is using she's opening up her esophagus, she's using you know her diaphragm properly, she's dropping the jaw. Um, and she's still smiling, like having the best time of her life. Okay, so who's this guy? Wind Chan. From the deep came to me and sang my name. They started in D minor, now they're in B flat. That's the the sixth. It's still in D. They're just they're making the sixth the root note of this bridge part. 
part of the band? Very clean. Not a whole lot of showy stuff, just clean to the point. I like it. Oh wow. The flutes. Strings. The timpani. The clarinet. What did it do? Bum, 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 bum. Oboes. The oboe doesn't get a lot of credit. The oboe, if played right, is one of the most beautiful. Change my mind. But the oboe and the English horn, if played incorrectly, can just be obnoxious sounding. Played correctly, some of the most beautiful sounding instruments you will ever hear in your life. The soon. Got the full thing. Is it tracked? Fire. Loop. Uh, so the crowd knows something's up. I'm assuming they've heard this before. Xylophone. Nice! That was awesome! As a, as a percussionist who played a lot of mallet instruments in, in high school, college, and in orchestras and symphonies, I love that. Effortless. Call it. Oh, here we go. Wow. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Tambourine. I'm there. I'm with you. Ah, oh, the horns.
Look how far she can open her her yapper, dude. That's unreal. Do you see how far she can open that up? Look at that, man. She could fit a Subway sandwich in there. That's crazy. Oh, cool. Oh, she's singing words. I thought she was just vocalizing. Okay, let me, let me try and catch those. My fall what? Are they saying something behind it? That means go again. Oh my god, dude, look at look, look. Wow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I, I almost have tears, look. Wow. Oh my god, is it do they close with this song? This is a perfect closer. Yeah, give me those pinch harmonics, baby. Dan, da da. <laughs> when we were playing live, because we played these songs so much, we usually had this little signal at the end. Myself and my buddy Eric, who was playing lead guitar, and then the rest of the band just kind of adopted it. Is we would hold, bam, and I would give them a random number: one, two, three, five. And that would be how many hits we would do at the end. And it would be different all the time. So we're holding, and I'd go, dun, dun, dun. Or, or like another night, we would hold it, and I'd go, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> it was just something to keep it new. And I wonder if they do something similar. That, this, I knew she could sing, man, but that note was unbelievable. I got to hear that again. I don't know if you guys saw, I almost had tears in my eyes. I don't know why. It just happened when she was singing. Golly! Man.
Let's go, baby! I wish I had hair to do that. Yeah, bam, bada. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Oh wow, that was incredible. Now I'm now I feel so terrible that I've actually never listened to them before. <laughs> oh, the song came out ten years ago. What have I missed out on? Holy cow, you guys. Okay, I want I want more. Give me give me more Nightwish, you guys. If you are if you are in the Nightwish community, if you, you've somehow made your way over to this channel, welcome. I love you. I'm I'm grateful that you're here. Um this is my first exposure to listening to Nightwish's actual music, and I want to hear more. So let's let's do it, y'all. Drop drop suggestions down there. Um, I I have no commentary on like the actual uh, chord progressions or, or or anything like that. Um, I don't have any commentary on the words. It was just epic. I wanted to take it all in for what it was. I would like to know what the choir is singing at the end, though, because there was this this thing being sung that the crowd is singing as well. Um, let me know what words they're singing, and then like just what the song is about—a ghost love score. Educate me, Nightwish fans, on what the song is is even about, since I wasn't really paying attention to the lyrics. But I'm looking forward to more Nightwish, you guys. Subscribe for more. We'll have more coming to you. Um, th the future of the channel is in your hands. You make the Nightwish suggestions, and I will get to it. Until next time, y'all have a great day. <laughs>